Anyway, Farm Simulator 2015 mods. Today's mod video, as you can see, check this out. Finally, have a working in the pretty much my favorite truck in 2013, the King Ranch F350. It is a beast. I don't know if they call it, yeah, F250. I'm sorry. I'm pretty sure in. 2013 it might be an f350 but as you can see also we are on a snow map uh this map's been uh, out for a while and uh the other day i was watching videos and i had the itch to grab this map up and i uh, decided to do the showcase on it and include it down for you guys because who doesn't like plowing snow so I decided to do that also and uh check this out this came out I believe yesterday or the day before same with this truck this truck came out yesterday also there was a conversion for this truck but it was garbage and it did not work at all but I love these Argos they're, they're very very cool and it's got a hitch on it so you can pull and this thing pulls like crazy you'd be surprised I can't get hooked up to this right here so we're just gonna go ahead and use the plow I spawned in two plows because in the store there were two different kinds so go over here and type in B turn off wind rower apparently the snow is wheat and uh, and you can bail it apparently <laughs> I don't know that's what it said in the description of the map this is my first time playing on it so we'll give it a try we're gonna lower this plow right here and look at that we're playing I like that that's so cool I wonder if I wish I could curve the plow because in a video I saw this other guy using a completely different plow that he was controlling. But nonetheless, this is really cool. I do like plowing and uh, snow maps a lot. So it looks like when I plow, all the stuff goes on the other side. I mean, it's realistic. Um, the snow just doesn't pile up on your plow exactly. So you just kind of gotta act like you're either mowing or you know just bailing anything because I it, it kind of confused me when it told me that the snow was actually wheat that's the uh, confusing part but this is cool though we'll go ahead and hook up to the other little plow right there and it came with this tractor also this Forte 190 don't know what it is but seems pretty cool so this truck doesn't have all the controls and stuff like the other one does but I loved the other one because it was so high textured and it looked so good and this one same it looks almost better I would say yeah it looks better the rims and everything you know this would be awesome I might edit this a little bit put my rims and tires on it so I can have a little truck of mine that looks just like mine I could play with but uh we're probably gonna do a six liter in the future if you guys would like that a uh, six liter f-250 that sounds something like we would do and also some 90s Ford F-250s. Give us suggestions guys. Uh, type in the comment box below and while you're down in the comments please give me a big like. The likes help the videos and the mod team help us grow tremendously. We would love it if you just liked the videos. Let's go right back in here. But yeah I really do. We want to make some 90's model Fords and we got some trailers like some low boys and stuff planned. Um, top kicks. All kinds of great stuff. So it looks like, I guess I can't, I don't know, let's see, attached, there we go. So this one seems exactly the same, maybe the other one has different numbers on it. 2040, and this was a 2040 I believe too. Yeah, so I guess they're the same things, but, so, we'll go ahead and hop out since those are literally the same, uh, I guess, plowers. There was another one, but a lot of people were saying to not download it. It caused a lot of issues in the game. So here's the little Argo. This thing's really cool because if you guys heard my last, I guess, two videos, my previous two videos, I said I was going to go camping and off-roading. And I was looking for some off-roading and awesome mods and camping style mods that I would use in that video. So this is going to be one of them. I'm so glad to have this thing now. But look at this little beast. I love Argos, and I wonder if this thing's actually amphibious. I don't think it will be, but we could try it on the Pleasant Valley map. But here's what I wanted to do the most. 
the awesome F-250 King Ranch. I love it. So we'll go ahead and spawn a trailer in and see how this guy hot hauls. Because I remember in the last version in 2013, this thing didn't haul too good because I stuck like two trucks in that box trailer and it couldn't haul it. So this might be a different revision, I guess, and they might have updated the suspension, but we'll go ahead and test that out. So we'll grab a PJ and, hmm, what should we put? Let's say, let's get a wheel loader. Because if this thing can pull this, we're good. That was my hauling test for the dually our team released was if it can haul this front loader. Here's the interior. The gauges don't work, but look how detailed this thing is. Very beautiful. LMS always makes some great mods. Also love that F-150 that they have, but this mod, I I'm impressed so much the textures and everything of it it looks like something that the actual game would put in this, this is a very good truck it does have a little bit of texturing issues with the uh, as you can see the artifacting on the paint but I, I think that's due to the high texture of the mod so we'll go ahead and back up windows are really tinted I like that because so are mine Okay, we're having an issue with this trailer. It's kind of getting cockeyed on the bed of the truck, I think. Let's see. No. Okay, just making sure. This um, map does cause a tad bit of frame lag that I'm noticing. Because I haven't had frame lag since I switched to this new recorder and this map was causing it. I think I caught, found the problem of my map and everything that was messing up in my game and everything because as you guys know I was stuck on the Hillsboro farm for a good minute so finally I can play on different maps forgot to put the ramps out what was I thinking alright cross your fingers guys because I had a hiccup with this loading it on the PJ when the PJ like flew into the air it was crazy so let's hope it doesn't do that and does any of you guys have a updated version to the trail tech? Oh. I don't know if we can do this, guys. But it's on. And it's not giving me any issues. So we'll go ahead and try it. But I, I, I downloaded another version of the trail tech. I saw on some guy's video that it was his was working perfectly. And he was hauling it with it. So I, I stuck a tractor on the the trail tech earlier and it flew straight back into the sky like it did before so I don't know I guess I'll leave it like that but this truck is a beast and it is hauling it good I have no complaints a very great mod I'm very very impressed you guys I'm so glad they released this for 2015 and I can't wait for them to come out with that Dodge uh, Longhorn flatbed truck that I also like so it's having a little bit of problems getting up this uh, hill right here, but it's snowy, so I don't know how that conflicts with the the grappling of the tires. Eh, it hauls good. This thing is really heavy. I usually haul it on that uh, low boy, that yellow one. So it's hauling it good, guys. No suspension problems. It's not even sagging. Trailer hitch. Everything looks great. Alright, but yeah guys, there it is, the F-250 King Ranch, F-250, 350 I guess you could call it too, because it's got a pretty long bed. So, alright guys, I'm going to leave it like that, please give me a like and a comment on this video, and stay to forward to some new camping videos that is going to be coming out with some of these mods that you're seeing right here. So, stay tuned for some cool videos guys, all the downloads are in the description if you have any problems, I can try to help you as best as I can, just bear with me, I get hundreds and hundreds of hundreds of messages every day and it's hard to get back to each of you, so I'm not ignoring you, I may see the thing but I can't reply to everybody each day, so I apologize for that, I try, literally, I sit there for hours and try to get to you guys, so, but yeah guys, uh, there it is, check it out, and I will see you guys in the next video, later.